Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this nice math problem involving root from here? We have 2 raised to power root 75 times 8 raised to power root 27 divided by 4 raised to power root 48 or raised to power root 3 over 12. And from here, we can rewrite this as 2 raised to power here root 75. We can separate it and say this is going to be root 25 times 3 from here. And the uh, root 25 same thing as 5. So we take 5 out, then that's 5 root 3. Then we can write this as 2 raised to the power 5 root 3. Then times 8 raised to the power root 27 as well. We can write that as root 9 times 3. And root 9 is 3, which is 3 root 3 from here. So that's 8 raised to the power 3 root 3. Then divided by here, we have 4 raised to the power root 48. And we can write root 48 also as root 16 times 3. And root 16 is 4, which is 4 root 3 now. So we have 4 raised to the power 4 root 3 here. Then, which is all raised to the power root 3 over 12. And uh, in the next step, let's change the number to half sin base. This is already to base 2, so we have into bracket 2 raised to the power 5 root 3. Then times here, we can say this is 2 raised to the power 3. That's 2 times 2 times 2, that's 8. Then raised to the power 3 root 3. Then divided by, also we can change 4 as well. To base 2, that's 2 raised to the power 2. We give us 4. Then raised to the power 4 root 3. Then or raised to the power root 3 over 12. Then from here, we open this power from the law of indices and then uh, this becomes into bracket 2 raised to power 5 root 3, see here. Then times this power multiplied, this becomes 2 raised to power 9 root 3 now. Then divided by, here becomes 2 raised to power 8 root 3. Then or raised to power root 3 over 12. Then also from here, we have same base multiplying. We can add the power. Then we have here into bracket 2 raised to power 5 root 3 now plus 9 root 3. Then divided by 2 raised to power 8 root 3. So, all raised to the power root 3 over 12. Then, we can sum this together because they are similar sort. So, when we have the coefficient, 5 plus 9, that's 14. So, this becomes 2 raised to the power 14 root 3. Then, divided by 2 raised to the power 8 root 3. Which is all raised to the power root 3 over 12 from here. Then, from here, also we have same base and which they divide. That means we can subtract the power. And uh, from here, this can be written as 2 raised to power, you know, 14 root 3 minus 8 root 3 now. So we can say this is 2 into bracket 2 raised to power 14 root 3 minus 8 root 3 which is raised to power root 3 over 12. And uh, from here, when we subtract this power, this gives us 2 raised to power 6 root 3, which is being raised to power root 3 over 12 from here. Then, from the law of indices as well, this power multiplies. We can say 6 here, 1, 6 here, we have 2, then root 3 times 
minus root 3 from here. That's 3. So we have 2 raised to the power 3 over 2. Then we can equally write this as square root of 2 raised to the power 3. And uh, 2 raised to the power 3 is 2 times 2 times 2, which is 8. So we can say the square root of 8. And uh, of course, which we can write as square root of 4 times 2. Because 4 times 2 is 8. And root 4, we can bring it as, as 2. That's 2 root 2. Then we have the solution to this problem as 2 root 2. Here we've come to the end of the class and thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more exciting videos. Turn on the notification bell. Share this video. Give a thumbs up. And uh, put your comment in the comment section. Thank you. See you in the next class. And